Hey, what's up guys? Hope everybody's doing well and having a great day. I wanted to do a quick update on the wildfire situation in California and South America as the tropical rainforests or part of the tropical rainforests in South America have been ablaze for a while. And I noticed something very unusual on Zoom Earth I want to share with you guys. I noticed some glowing gravity waves that, that hunt around for about 24 hours, somewhere in the neighborhood of 400 miles wide. Quite the spectacle. We're going to come back and take a look at that here in a minute. But first, over here in California, California. I'm on this webcam right here in the northern part of the, the San Francisco Bay Area. We know that the, the air quality over here has been terrible for weeks on end, but I think today's probably been one of the most visually bad days I've seen over here in quite some time. This is this afternoon at 2.15, and that is almost zero visibility from this camera. You can't hardly see maybe a half a mile or a quarter mile in front of you because there is hardly any wind, and what wind that there is, the, the smoke is just drifting from the glass fire. That is, I think, 60,000 acres right now. Uh, just an unbelievable wildfire year. Nearly 3.8 million acres consumed this year. This fire here is 60,000 acres, 6% 6 contained. It's very challenging to combat these fires because of the, the very mountainous terrain. But visually and air quality wise, I think today's probably one of the, the worst I've seen throughout uh, the, the duration of these wildfires that I've been watching. And you can see the air is just very, very thick. It almost looks like a fog. And it's like that on a lot of these cameras. At first I thought the cameras had switched to a, a black and white format. I really did. And I got to moving around because I've been following these for a long time now. And some days you'd come over here and the, the camera would be like a glowing orange or a deep burgundy. And today, a lot of these, here's another one. You can see it almost, with the exception of right here in the front, look like a black and white format. Here's another one. Look, looks like black and white. Hopefully some rain will move in here soon, uh, get some winds and, and clear this area out because they certainly need it. The wildfire season this year has definitely been one for the record books. You can see the carbon monoxide concentrations here at 6,300 parts per billion in the general area. Even down here in the northern Baja levels are near 5,000 parts per billion. But if you go to South America, near the tropical rainforest, in fact, some of the tropical rainforests are on fire right now. But there's a very large one right here in the south central part of South America where the carbon monoxide levels are 43,245 parts per billion. That's six times the concentration levels that we're seeing right now. Actually, more than six, over seven times the levels we're seeing right now in California. And that's in these areas here. And those are like the lungs of the earth. Those big trees are, are carbon soldiers. They take carbon out of the atmosphere, and right now they're being overwhelmed with carbon. And I was down here looking over here on, on Zoom Earth, and you can see the smoke quite easily here in the visible format. And I was stepping this forward, you know, an hour at a time, and I noticed this big collection of gravity waves move up from the south to the north right into the Rio area. And these things measure about 400 miles wide at one point, and it looks like they're being influenced by the wildfire smoke. Check this out. You're going to see what looks like a big set of wings move up across the ocean here. Check this out. Really weird. This goes on for 24 hours. They, they disappear and they reappear again in the overnight hours. Appear to be almost glowing. Look at that. Unreal. And those are, I measured on Google Earth, those extend nearly, well, check this out. They extend from here to here. 400 miles, look at that. A little over 400 miles wide. Those things are huge and they stick around for a while. They go right into the, the coastline there. They almost look like they were glowing. Those would have made some very photogenic uh, skies down there. Here they come again. Here's another round early in the morning right before sunrise. Now we're going into October 2nd. What I showed you was October 1st. And here we go today late morning. Those are over 400 miles wide. Those are huge. Look at that. Watch. We're going to step it forward an hour at a time. And these two make the same journey right up into the same general area. And that's wildfire smoke. Look at that. See the different color? It's coming from here and making its way back up. Look at that. And those two go into the coast. And then they kind of stick around at night too, but that's about as far as I can go right up into here. Yeah, that's as far as I can go. 
to five. So we'll see if they come back later. I'll, I'll check it out. But the the concentrations of carbon monoxide down there are the highest I've ever seen here at nullschool.net. I've never seen them above like 15,000. That's 43,000. That's in an entirely new league. And once again, those are tropical rainforests you're seeing there at Zoom Earth that are up in flames, which is very concerning considering those trees take a lot of carbon out of the atmosphere. They help keep everything balanced in our ecosystem. And to see those on fire like that, it genuinely is very concerning. Just like over in California, as bad as the wildfires have been this year, it is very concerning. You know, wildfires, manageable wildfires, are actually good for the earth. But when they get out of control like this, it's an entirely different league. Also tonight, step outside after dark, look in the southern skies, you'll see Mars and the moon within one degree of each other. Anytime after 8 o'clock, if it's not cloudy in your area, I'll try to grab a couple of pictures if I can, but they'll be within one degree of each other, actually 1.14, at around 8.15 tonight, all the way through most of the, the nighttime hours, if the skies are clear where you're at. So don't forget to step outside and just basically look south. Once again, we've got glowing gravity waves off the coast of South America. Thanks for watching. Have a super day and be safe out there.